Clock's ticking here. Back to Curry. In the corner. Curry hits a three. Warriors ball here. On a wild night in the NBA, Golden State is looking scary again. And everyone was afraid that this could happen. Then we got an overtime thriller in Los Angeles where AD and LeBron completely went off. Wemby was all fired up for his rivalry against Chet and he made the entire arena explode. But we gotta start in the garden and follow Steph here as he's going to set a brush screen for Green, then gets a pick himself, curls and gets another one up top and an open look off of this beautiful play for the splash. He was running around all over the court, getting screens and firing away from downtown for his 31 points. And thing is, Steph was also setting picks himself. Watch him stop two defenders here like an NFL linebacker, allowing for Green to walk his way to the rim. Unbelievable. Draymond there you go. to the rim to lay it in. Steph set the screen. He took away two men. Now this is the Steph Curry effect. Watch the completely empty lane here for him, but I guess this shot is an even higher percentage than a layup, and of course he knocks it down. Golden State is 12-3 in their last 15 games and they're looking scary. I'm telling you, no team wants to see them in the play-in, playoffs or any type of setting, especially when they've got their confidence back. Speaking of that, Wemby was all confident and fired up for his matchup against Chet and the Thunder. And boy, did he deliver. Gilgis Alexander, blocked away again by Victor. Long ball inside. There you go. Victor Wembanyama. This was a tough back and forth battle throughout the entire game. The Spurs were playing great, but OKC wanted to show why they are at the top of the West. It's got 11. Backdoor pass. And one. But in the fourth quarter, Wimbanyama and the Spurs completely took over. Oh, Wimbanyama! Vassell, back to Victor. Another three. Get out of here! Oh my goodness! That was from Paris, Texas. And you could see after every clutch bucket how much this game meant for Victor. The reactions and the emotions showed us everything we needed to see. All of that culminated on this possession where he absolutely destroyed Holmgren's shot. Holmgren trying to answer. He is stuffed and taken away. Wow, mano a mano rookie battle and Wimby comes out as the clear winner in this one. A 20 year old alien with this type of will to win, man, things are about to become insane in the next few seasons. And insane it was last night for the Lakers. Down by three in overtime, things got worse on this turnover and fast break. But then... Goes two all the way. Oh, LeBron does it again! Blocked by James! LeBron still has it in him to go up for these monster chase down blocks. Amazing! And just seconds later, after saving the day on defense, he did this. One of the plays of the game without question to tie it up. He's got it! Defense at one end! Hit! from downtown at the other. Then the very next possession, the great cut and the assist. Dino bounce, LeBron, here he goes, great kick. Finish AD, slam dunk. James single-handedly saved this from being a five-point deficit and made it a two-point lead. Wow. But what's interesting is that this would end up being the last field goal of the game. In a chaotic last two minutes, no team was able to score and the Lakers found themselves with a three-point lead in the final seconds. So all they needed was one final stop. Of opportunities at the end of regulation here in overtime has yet to really convert. Now Kuzma for the tie. They tap it all the way out, but it goes to Rui. It went to Rui and the Lakers are going to win it. Lakers hold on and win it. 40 points and 15 rebounds for AD and 31 and 9 for LeBron to secure another much needed win for the Lakers. Things are starting to heat up, especially in the West as we get closer and closer to the playoffs. Minnesota is still leading the way at the top. And if you ask their fans, this team has the vibes of the iconic 2004 squad with Kevin Garnett, Latrell Sprewell and Sam Cassell that went to the conference finals exactly 20 years ago. I made a video all about that and if you're an OG NBA fan, you gotta check it out right here. Talk to you in the next one, peace out.